I've just blown my nose, so I'm covering it because I've got a big red nose. <laughs> Feisty New Yorker, probably Gladys Knight would be num my number one. And of course Bowie, but it's too late for that now. But um, I'm open-minded, you know. Ariana Grande. <laughs> Will I perform in Chicago? Actually, an announcement coming soon regarding a tour next year with a very exciting band, Coach Club and one other band, but I can't tell you any more than that. Wood chip, darling, it never went out of fashion. Outfits for The Voice, I need 36 in total, but I've got more than that. I have sent a tweet, got no response. Bette Midler's never replied to me. <laughs> Bette Midler hates me. Where do babies come from? Louis Vuitton, of course. Favourite lyric, here in the darkness I became the light. I had to get it wrong to get it right. What song is that from? My guilty pleasure, Julio Iglesias. There's a great video of him singing with the leader, I love Yon Rose on YouTube. It's so beautiful. Yeah, Julio. The capital of Peru is Lima or Lima, depending on where you come from. I used to really hate singing Time Clock of the Heart, but I've kind of embraced it now. Now that I'm working with this new vocal coach. Ma, 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 ma. Funniest fan encounter was in H&M in Sydney, and this man came up and said, Are you George Michael? I said, No, I'm not. He said, I'm your biggest fan. And I said, Well, you don't know who I am. <laughs> I did a selfie anyway, because I'm nice. I'm afraid I can't choose between the Pet Shop Boys and Erosion because I love them both. I worked for the Pet Shop Boys, did the crying game with them. And Andy Bell is gorgeous. Once brought me some flowers to my house.